Well, 372 degrees Fahrenheit. We are going way the hell up in temperature. Ah, yes. Thank you, Snapped. Razul. Who we have just killed, so... Oh, well, he's not in any of the other movies. And, uh, apparently it's his ghost here. Oh, and apparently the other thief was supposed to be Gazim, the guy who dies in the intro of the movie. You know, the one who goes into the Cave of Wonders, but is not worthy. And, mm, you were... You're doing so good up until this point, game. That just looks terrible. <laughs> yeah, aside from a little bit of blockiness, Razul there looks really good. Where's the princess? Just... All of the, um, compression nonsense. Our enemies. Good to know. Wait, wait, oh. Spikes poking out from the wall. And, and, are you freaking serious, game? There are spikes right here behind the uh, pillar. That is not cool. Okay, this whole section is garbage. Well, apparently, the bits of the foreground cover up the bits of, you know, the number of gems and my lives. <laughs> That's kind of a thing I have not often seen. feeling that this area is a maze, isn't it? No, we found a checkpoint, so, you know, presumably we're going in the correct direction, and if there's a thing I was supposed to pick up in the other direction, then, uh, I'm just gonna say, screw it, I don't care. <laughs> this game is not worth any of this effort. There is actually only one path throughout all this, and nothing to uh, pick up or anything like that, so that I am pretty okay with. Okay, so how about it? Merchant who might actually be the genie. If anything, for... nothing for restoring health. We bought a scroll, whatever a scroll actually does. I do see extra health up there, so we can kill this bat. Yeah. 
Okay, so evidently uh, scroll is a continue, so basically as expected with that. without taking additional damage, it will be worthwhile. Okay, doing much better now. And it's good that the game only threw the, um, totally bullshit, uh, spike and swinging ball and chain things at us at the very start, not throughout the entire stage. incredibly happy when we get out of this stage, because this block-shifting noise is not really good. <laughs> yep, I remember that scene in the movie where there's just a big old neon exit sign in the dungeon. and exactly what was in the movie. Okay, those are spikes that we shouldn't be hitting. No way to... Okay, come here, bat. Okay, seriously, what the hell? A bat should not be one of the most difficult things to kill in your game. So how do you actually... Is there a run button, or...? I, I guess you just have to be super pixel perfect with your jumping. Okay, good to know. Yep. And I do wonder. No, 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 no ramifications whatsoever. And spit and fish. And water is death, so... Excuse me, how? Take that and then... Okay, what? Well, 
hit the statues. I didn't. Okay. Good to know. Did not see that earlier. So yeah, we've gone from, you know, touch nothing but the lamp to desecrate everything possible. Also, next to impossible to see enemies. Uh, the forearm thing is an enemy invented for the game. Much like the spitting fish and all of these bats. Since, you know, there wasn't enough peril in the Cave of Wonders to begin with. Yeah, so, a lot of nonsense that way. Well, we'll I, I, I would say we'll save that, but we likely won't be coming back that way, so it likely won't make any difference. bothering to pick up the gems now that I know it's only for extra lives and extra continues, which we really don't need. Also, turbaned spirit ghost things? Okay. Don't know why, but sure. No, I think it's in the bad way. <laughs> That's interesting. They're really loving these pixel perfect jumps over here. And the bats. Cannot forget the bats. get to those pieces of health. I think those were on the other side of a wall. Hi there! Wait, what? No. Er, -er, -er, er So, um... Can't grab onto that. Okay. There we go. <laughs> and of course... Now we can get through here. Are you freaking serious? Oh my god! That's... Well, it's not even! even though it's absolutely and completely ridiculous. Of course, I say easy enough boss, and then I take all of the damage possible. Seriously. Hitboxes in this game are so terrible. I does this take so many hits to kill? Thank you! Now let's get on our entirely blue carpet. Now 
then, then he just goes away. Sure, why not? Five hundred seventy-four degrees Fahrenheit. I'll have to start looking into the melting points of various things soon. We already passed the uh, flash point ignition of vapor. over 300 degrees Celsius, so we are pretty soon going to be hitting the melting points of various metals. You know, outside of the obvious stuff like mercury and stuff that's a liquid at room temperature, which is kind of duh. <laughs> Okay with that sort of boulder thing, it wasn't really gaining on me in any way, so... Also, one thing I cannot help but continually notice the fact that the apples are square. Because that's just the thing with the Game Boy Color. It has square coloring some of the time. Lava eruption or what it was that hurt me there, but eh. Whoop, whoop, oh, wait. Okay. Wait, but I what the hell game? No, seriously. What the hell, game? Thank you! Yeah, no real indication that that's what you're supposed to do, but sure. 